Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, we'll be taking a look at a new trailer for Tekken 8. It has the release date, some exclusive content reveal. Uh, and this came out a couple of days ago, but I hadn't been able to record anything until today. So let's go check out the trailer. We'll come talk about a little bit more about this upcoming game. Here's the trailer for Tekken 8. May contain inappropriate uh, content for children, huh? Oh, look at that. You know, we have a lot of uh, a lot of fighting games that have come out in the past couple of months and coming up in the next couple of years, like a month of coming. We have, I think, Street Fighters already out, and we have new Mortal Kombat game. And, but Tekken's always had its own like main different feel, which I like. Uh, like their their characters feel like very well constructed. Not that the other ones don't, just. They just feel like they could only belong in a game like Tekken. Let's go. There's some really great visuals too. These are, I know these probably are not like from in-game, but some of these could be part of their cinematic attacks. All right, let's see what some of the, the new features here. Right. You can make your own little uh, player. I'm not a big fan of doing stuff like this, but I know people like that. And, oh, looks like you can do a lot of customization with the outfits. That could probably get real interesting or very weird very fast. Oh, look at those gold outfits. They're ridiculous. Oh, what the hell? You know, not not being up to the lore and all the characters and like checking uh, overall, like some of this thing is just it looks interesting but very very weird. But some really cool visuals so far. I appreciate that. Good music too. The fighting game needs good music. All right, January twenty sixth to twenty twenty four. Uh, that should give me plenty of time to get through Mortal Kombat uh, before this. It looks like we have a few different editions. Uh, hopefully, they'll tell us what uh, what's in all these. What are we what are we paying those extra bucks for? Okay. So the deluxe edition just gives you a few all oh, the gold suit for everyone, I guess. Ultimate edition gets you some. Okay, you get extra characters, some avatar skins. Oh, nice! They have an actual premium collector's edition. Now, does this come with a physical game or just a code? That's the only thing. Um, so that looked very cool. I, the only question I really had was about the. So that looked really cool. The only question I really had was about the uh, when it comes to the premium collector um, edition. Like sometimes these don't come with a physical game anymore. Like they just send you a steelbook, which is weird. Uh, but this looks cool. I like the statue. Uh, I hope it's a good quality statue. I've been burnt in the past before. Uh, I'm gonna try to get this if if I can. But I like look. It's got the little metal ring. Some cards, the the tokens, like all that stuff. Usually, I'll end up losing it if I don't keep it in the box. But uh, and then you get all the digital rewards. So, but usually when I buy a special edition, I definitely want physical content. So this definitely uh, marks all the boxes there. So I'm interested. Uh, let's see if I can still pre-order that. We'll see. If if I do, I'll probably make a little video when I get it to unbox it. So follow along. Uh, if you have watched this trailer, uh, let me know what you think about it. Maybe there'll be a beta for this one like there was for Mortal Kombat, uh, which I'm already getting to play a little bit. Uh, so, yeah, stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff here in the channel. And as always, thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye. <laughs>